everybody to Medium Rare Poetry. My name's Philae Mignong and I'm beaming to you today live from Mars. Well, Mars on Earth. Today's poem relates to extraterrestrials. No need to be afraid. They've been with us for thousands of years. How else do we get all these great ideas that have advanced our technology over the millennia? So today's poem will explain to you from a completely unreliable source, moi, on what will possibly happen in the next couple of years regarding ETs. This is Transfiguration. Transfiguration by Philae Mignon. A marvellous time to be on earth, to witness change, a fresh rebirth. At last we came to understand that we were not so smart or grand. It started with a bright full moon, when lunatics are known to swoon. We marvelled at the eerie light that bathed the world that fateful night. Appearing as a mass of stars, a fleet of craft dropped in from Mars. With subtle telepathic charm, they told us that they meant no harm. Of course, our leaders, blind and deaf, released the hounds of warring death. They'd hoarded weapons over time, protection for their weak behinds. They launched a mighty space attack to drive these ET vehicles back. Foreseen was this and caused no fuss, for eons they'd been watching us. Caution was the tactic here, their good intentions were made clear. They snuffed the Earth's elite defence, so much for our intelligence. Rockets, nukes and all such crap, engulfed with ET bubble wrap. Our weapons placed upon the ground. Yes, these would be museum bound. The rich and famous ran to hunker to their fancy preppy bunkers. With that, the craft deployed their beams and sealed them up for good, it seemed. So just us common folk were left to welcome in our Martian guests. No space invaders were this lot. They'd come to cool our planet hot. We always knew we weren't alone, the universe, our flesh and bone. Our visitors acknowledged that and shared with us a bunch of facts. They taught us we could live in peace, jealous greed and war would cease. By helping one another out, our planet would no longer pout. We all were gifted common sense, enlightened, and no longer dense, we shed our ignoramus fog, released from superstitious bog. Our inner light had now been triggered, with E.T. help, we were transfigured. So transfiguration is all about us changing into a more advanced race of human beings where we don't have all the base feelings that we currently endure. And there's nothing to be afraid of from extraterrestrials. You can be more afraid of our leaders who keep waging wars and doing all sorts of stupid things. Anyway, I hope this poem has been enlightening for you. And I stress there's no need to be afraid of ETs. Thanks so much for listening. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, share and subscribe before you go and press the notification bell. I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye bye for now.